I'm Lauren Plume here at Poly Pavilion at UCLA. We're here to watch Cal Poly take on Denver in the first round of the NCAA Women's Volleyball Tournament. Uh, Cal Poly is 26 and 2 right now, and they're on a 21 game win streak. Uh, Denver's record sits at 12 and 2 in the Summit Conference and 23 and 5 overall. Uh, just a quick uh, heads up on the matchup we have here, a little statistical breakdown. Cal Poly is highly ranked in most statistical categories in the NCAA. They sit at second in kills per set, whereas Denver sits at 36. They sit at fourth in assists per set, and Denver is at 39th. Taylor Nelson is fifth in the nation for a player in assists per set. Hitting percentage, Cal Poly is sixth in the nation, and Denver is 38th, which is actually behind Hawaii, which is in Cal Poly's conference. They played twice this year and beaten five sets. Uh, Denver only is higher in ace per set and a opposition hitting percentage. Denver has managed to hold their opponents to a 165 average against hitting, which means Cal Poly has to take that into account, take into account the defense of Denver. They can't, just because Denver isn't as high on the attacking statistics, they can't sleep on the fact that Denver is a great defensive team. We have Tori Van Winden on our team with 10, that's 10th in the nation with kills per set, and Savannah Neiman, 17th in the nation with hitting percentage of 314. That's just three players, Taylor Nelson, Savannah Neiman, Tori Van Winden, but Cal Poly has loads of great players, Adley Van Winden, Catherine Broker in the back row. And uh, tonight, I think the only decision that they really have to make for the Mustangs, Sam Crossan is going to have to decide who is going to be his second middle blocker. Savannah Neiman is obviously the first starter for the night, but then you have Madeline Mercer, Nikki Jackson, and Nadia Redoff, who have all played about equal through this season. Madeline Mercer most recently has been playing for the Mustangs. So uh, we'll keep you updated live here. Let's see how this goes.